Okay, just like to thank you for submitting on time. Uh, always appreciate it and always helps when it comes to giving uh, feedback on time. Thank you very much. So what I'm going to do, just talk through some of the comments uh, that um, I've added as I've gone through your assignment. And then hopefully we can uh, kind of discuss this and have a bit more dialogue uh, regarding how to develop for future assignments. Okay, so as I just starting off here, there was, I think, from the first instance here, I think possibly kind of reframing the introduction would work. So as I've put there, uh, a more informed opening that sets the scene for the essay. And then as well on the second comment there where possibly this rephrase would be a really good opening and then the rest could develop around it. And then as we come on to this, there's a, quite a few claims that are being made and you just need to look to substantiate these uh, with kind of informed research and making sure that this remains structured for, for, for its purpose. Any of the claims uh, as are there um, will kind of limit it being like a fragmented piece from the outset. So you want to start strongly and then follow this through. And as we come down there, so we've got recorded lectures are a form of digital hand holding, and perhaps that is the case, but let's look at not being too simplistic about this and then developing your points again a bit more coherently just to make sure that when you come up against these uh, different viewpoints, you can balance them out and you can kind of um, fully explain what's going on. And then I've just posed a little question there. So, uh, what about if students uh, need what lecturers are not equipped to give them? So that's another kind of alternative view. So again, the balance can can um, really develop your arguments here. Again, I've just highlighted this bit. Just make sure that you do proofread uh, prior to or have uh, a critical friend proofread as small things can just get kind of mixed up. So there you go small things but again it does kind of add to it so in this section here I've just put down that um, you need to support it a bit more um, otherwise it can become a little bit of a rant um, whereas that's not what you want to do you want to make sure that there's an informed discussion around balanced viewpoints and although you do have some valid points in there just make sure that they're clearly underpinned and then sometimes the way you can kind of simplify that um, is by having the balance from the outset 